Yeah, Dining in the Dark, this is the second year in a row we've done it. And it's just really a, a neat collaborative event. Just as there's blindness and visual impairment, uh, there's also a, a, blind, a blindness at times in the community of hunger in our community and food insecurity, you know, you can call it, uh, where it can be invisible at times. And this is for, you know, the, the food bank and then for the lighthouse um, dealing with uh, blind, blind children, blind individuals. And it's good to interact in, with people that care for that and know that we care. I mean, this is, this is the far, our way to give back to the community. It's, it's very similar to what we see with many clients who come into Lighthouse Central Florida for help. And there's a lack of confidence. You're not sure where things are. You're gonna move real slow and you're gonna explore your environment in a very different way. And you're also gonna rely on, on your other senses uh, a lot more astutely than you usually would because you're not gonna have the benefit of sight tonight. Somebody spilled water and they, they just tried to pretend like it didn't happen. And uh, when I call them out on it, they're like, oh, that was me, that was me. So. It's a very intimate experience because you have to really rely on the people next to you to figure out where your, where your utensils are, where um, the water is, you know, where your glass is. It's very, um, it's a humbling experience. I land out sitting on newspaper, check it out, yeah, do us the favor, promise that you will love it later, I promise we got Central Florida flavor, yeah.